Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It's me, Mr. Four Caps Killer. I have purposely turned on all my lights in this room. This is a 138 inch uh, screen projector that you're looking at. And the movie that you're looking at right now, it's uh, Thor Rangarook. And uh, I'm using my Belkin HDMI 2.1 cable. And I have to tell you, uh, this cable really reads that HDR in the best possible way. They weren't kidding when they said, hey, if you want to watch Dolby Vision, if you want to watch HDR, you definitely want to use this HDMI 2.1 cable. Uh, now, having said that, I understand that the HDMI 2.1, it's not ready for prime time because it's not using its full potential of 48 megabits per second. I get that. But believe me, guys, if you're in the market for an... Uh, HDMI cable, this is it. This cable right here for 29 bucks, it's gonna give you the best possible HDR and 4K picture quality for both movies and video games. And here I am even from uh, eight feet away and this thing looks great. As you'll see, there's plenty of lights in this room and, and just look how bright it is. Maybe I can play one scene. I know this video will be copyrighted and I'm not going to monetize this video. I understand that it's Disney, it's Marvel. But I just want you guys to... I want to give you a quick, brief uh, experience that I have with this cable. And even on this scene right here, uh, the detail of HDR, it's really crystal clear. It's picture perfect clear and clean maybe I can get a little bit closer just to kind of give you guys some idea here even though I know with this camera you cannot see what I'm seeing but you'll just have to trust me that it looks pretty darn great uh, you will not be disappointed by this uh, HDMI cable this HDMI cable definitely here as you can see even with a lit up room here here, as you can see, I have my lights and everything here, so you know that uh, my room is lit up here. And it looks pretty outstanding. Uh, by the way, the transfer of this movie, it's really good. Also, you guys have to understand a couple of things, too. Uh, I'm using a very good 4K player. I'm using a Oppo UDP203, which is state-of-the-art 4K player. And on top of that, I'm also using HDMI 2.1 cable. And on top of that, I'm also using a 4K HDR uh, BenQ HD 2550 projector with 2200 luminous light and uh, full white color gamut goes beyond Rec 709, goes up to BT 2020. Okay, and if you guys don't know what the Rec 709 is or what the BT 2020 is, I suggest Google it because I don't have time to explain on this video. So this is a quick video. Uh, I just want to let you know that uh, rest assured, guys, even though I will do a bunch of tests, I will test Samsung KS8000. I'm going to test my monitor. I still have a bunch of tests. This, this will take a while for me to truly test this uh, age of my 2.1 cable but i can tell you <clears throat> i can tell you excuse me uh what i have experienced so far with this uh belkin 2.1 cable uh easily if you're into 4k if you if you're building a home theater if you have an oled uh if you got an oppo 4k player or apple 4k tv and you want the best possible hdr uh this is it man um get the cable now me personally, I think the best way to experience 4K and HDR is on a big giant screen. I like what you're seeing here. This is 138 inch diagonal. The reason you don't see the black bars because it's filling up the entire screen, the ratio. Uh, because that's that's what the projectors do. Okay, if you put it on a small screen TV like a 55 inch 16 by 9, then you're gonna see those black bars top to bottom. Here, you're not gonna see. That's not the case. Um, so. There you have it, guys. You know. Tomorrow I might do some live streams. I don't know. We might do the part three of uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Okay, we might do that tomorrow. So uh, 
I don't know yet. I'll keep you guys posted, uh, but uh, we'll see. Anyway, thank you for watching, guys. Have a nice Friday night. Have a good uh, Saturday morning. Stay safe. Stay positive. Be good to one another. Take care.